morning. I'm Miss Irving, and this is Bronco News. Today's story is all about pumpkin traditions. We were able to get an exclusive interview with some Daleville locals about their traditions with pumpkins. Let's go to Miss Irving in the field to get a closer look. Why, thank you, Miss Irving. I'm going to start heading out to look for uh, some amazing Daleville locals to uh, interview. So here we go. Let's see who hey, you Bronco from. News. I'm here with Mrs. Reed, and we're asking her what are her pumpkin traditions for this fall season? Well, some of my pumpkin traditions are we go and get our pumpkin from the patch, of course. and we carve it, and we um, get all the goo out of it, and mm -hmm. then um, we uh, set it out and start, we put a candle in it at night and let the, let the pumpkin glow. And then we clean the seeds and we mm -hmm. bake it. We put a little oil and some salt on and we bake it. That's oh, my wow. tradition. Wow, that sounds like a great yeah. tradition. Maybe you, boys and girls, maybe you ought to start doing yeah. that with your pumpkin seeds. Yeah. Well, thank you, Mrs. Thank Reed. you. Okay, let's see if we can find some more people to interview around here. Hello, Bronco <laughs> News. I'm here with my special guests. Mr. Joseph and Mrs. Beard, and they're going to tell you a little bit about their pumpkin traditions that they do for the fall season. Thank you so much. Um, so is my it's microphone on. on? Okay, yes, it is on. Um, so what we do with our family tradition is that we always go to the pumpkin patch, and we look for the pumpkins that match our personality. So sometimes Ooh. we have to look for the tall ones or sometimes the really short ones, and it, uh, it's really fun to go look through all the pumpkins. We then take them home, and we open the pumpkins, and then we take out all of the pumpkin insides out, mm -hmm. and we separate and we take the seeds out. Then we put, the seed, we put some seasoning on the seeds and put them in the oven mm -hmm. so that we can actually eat the pumpkin seeds as well. Yeah. We've had some of those traditions for uh, some of our other friends we've interviewed. What about you, Mrs. B? When I was young, that's what we used to do. We used to take out the middle and um, plant the, we would plant the seeds and raise oh. pumpkins or save them for the next year to plant. And we would also roast them so that we could eat them. As my kids um, grew up, we would go pick a pumpkin and we would do different carvings on them. But then as they got older, we found some of those really difficult carvings where you could yes. do the Disney ones with the yeah. Mickeys and the Minis. Very detailed. So we have those out. And my family, um, even though this, it's not a pumpkin tradition, but we always get together on Halloween at my house. Mm -hmm. So we have everything pumpkin. Oh, and then yeah. we have all the pumpkins out for everyone to see, see. when they go by. Oh, so. beautiful. Wow, those seems like really awesome traditions. Thank you so much. Uh, Mrs. Beard, you said when, um, when you were younger. Was that last year? That was many last years ago. Many last years. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you, Mr. Thank you. Joseph and Mrs. Beard. And I'm here with a very special guest, Mrs. K. So, Mrs. K, what do you do for your fall season pumpkin traditions? Well, we like to go to the pumpkin patch and we'll pick a pumpkin then we'll carve the pumpkin and we bake the pumpkin seeds. We like to do um, cinnamon and sugar pumpkin seeds are our favorite. Mm -hmm. That's definitely my family's favorite too. Well, thank you. You're welcome. Well, those were some great exclusive looks into what Daleville locals do during the fall season with their pumpkins. So let's see what you guys all do. I would love to. Back to you, Miss Irving, in the studio. Thanks for that great exclusive, Miss Irving. Really interesting insight on some traditions that we might want to do or that we already do for this beautiful fall season. We will now cut to commercial. When we return, we will go to Miss Irving with the calendar and a surprise guest for the weather.